I'm playing devil's advocate as much as I am. <laughs> you never, you never do that, Randy. But I do want to play devil's advocate with this. Okay, AI hallucinates and it makes mistakes. Granted. Yeah. Well, you know who else makes mistakes? Human doctors, right? We've all heard stories. At what point? Like, how close are we with something even that serious? where the AI, the mistakes will be less than it will be with the humans. Yeah. I think when you have a human in the loop, I, I think I saw some data that I can't point to directly, but like the AI was in the, in the 90% for some kind of exotic stuff and doctors were like in the high 70%. So the AI was doing better with the help of a doctor. The problem is that without the help of a doctor, you don't get past that hallucination potentially. Right? right. And so what happens is people stop halfway through the process and they take bad advice and run with it. Right. So so that's an AI that's incredibly well trained, not a general AI that you and I have access to with like Claude or ChatGPT or so. So so I do think that AI um, supporting doctors makes doctors materially better. Uh, I think that that cutting domain experts out of the loop right now in low consequence scenarios is low consequence in high consequence scenarios is high consequence. So my guidance to people is like, just do it in places that aren't going to cause irreversible damage.